Hi, my name is Mary Poffenroth, and I'm an adjunct professor of biology. I'm going to talk about good bacteria versus bad bacteria. Aren't all bacteria bad? Isn't that why we have our instant hand sanitizer always at the ready to kill that 99.9% .9 of germs? Absolutely not. In fact, if all the bacteria on the planet were to disappear today, all of the other organisms, the plants, the animals, the fungi, including us, would cease to exist. We need bacteria. For humans, bacteria help to aid in digestion, to produce vitamins, as well as to keep us healthy. And for the ecosystems, bacteria help to recycle nutrients and are an essential part of every healthy ecosystem. So what is a bacteria? Well, a bacteria is a prokaryotic organism, which means that this single-celled prokaryotic organism does not have their DNA located in an organelle, like a nucleus. But even though the majority of bacteria are completely harmless to humans, there are some of those critters that are harmful, and we call them pathogens. Pathogenic bacteria make humans sick by excreting a toxin. Either it's an exotoxin or an endotoxin. Exotoxins is a toxin excreted outside of the cell. An endotoxin is going to be a protein toxin that's found on the outside of the membrane of the cell. Now our best defense against pathogenic bacteria are antibiotics. However, our overuse and inappropriate use of antibiotics and antimicrobials is causing some bacteria to become resistant. So next time you reach for that instant hand sanitizer, think about the impact that your choices have on the health of your environment as well as yourself. Thanks for watching, and if you want to learn more about this subject, click on the link below. Or if you want to learn more biology, feel free to click on any links around me. And please, rate, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Or maybe, if you have ideas for more videos, send us an email at requests at mahalo.com. Thanks for learning.